All right, I should have started this recording when this place was super dirty, but I've already rinsed off all the major stuff. So we had a pretty big storm the other day. So there were pine needles and leaves and everything on top of the camper. I have not washed it since we bought it. So, well, four months, five months. Um, so hope you enjoy this. All right, thanks for clicking on my video. If you are watching this channel, you will see a bunch of random cooking, cleaning, hiking, family adventure, you name it, whatever I'm thinking, a few tutorials here and there. So if you enjoy what you've seen uh, in previous videos, or if you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. done with the roof let's get the tools down and we'll start on the sides the product I'm using is this um, easy house wash it is a um, hold on. it's a product that says it's mold armor covers up to 5600 square feet kills mold and mildew blasts away Algae stains, dirt and debris, cleans siding, brick, concrete, and trim. So I've used a product in the past called Crud Cutter, and I was looking for that, but they only had the big gallons that hook to a pressure washer at my Lowe's. So I went with this, uh, and it seems to be working great. There was some, um, not mold, but just, you know, build up and stuff on the roof. Um, from the past couple of months, but seem to do a good job. All right, let's knock out the rest of the outside. All right, done with the driver's side. Now we'll move to the front cap and the passenger side of the coach.
Done, done, done. Now let's get some brownie points. Do an equipment review real quick just because there's some stuff I like and some stuff I don't. The scrub brush head did pretty good and I was looking at a wooden stick but I think these companies are rigged because the wooden stick was cheap but when you'd screw it in it like wouldn't tighten. It'd screw in and like hold it but it wouldn't tighten but this $18 one screwed in and, and held it. Uh, Blue Hawk wash brush I might have got a little bit of stiffer brush if I was doing it again. This reach extension pole broke like the first second I had it. So that's supposed to be there. That snapped off. It still like tightens and works, but I'm going to take that back because that was the first time I used it. And within two seconds it broke. This hose is the zero G hose. So it, it's a half inch, 50 foot. Uh, this thing was pretty great. And I like these for the RV because they're compact and they store very easily. And then the Mold Armor Easy House, house Wash worked out great. I probably would, oh, there is a jet setting. Oh, I was complaining that it didn't have that, but it does have a jet setting. So if I had paid attention in red, I would have known that. Um, so yeah, this is a pretty good product all around. You don't need to switch back and forth to this spray nozzle now that I read that it has a jet set. But, um, so that's that, hope you enjoyed. Get out and clean.